87 Patrick Schick road to the knockout stage is here he looks like an absolute finisher gonna be able to finish everything in front of his plate not super fast but he is massive six foot three high medium with four star skills and three star weak foot got no acceleration he's basically on one leg but when it comes to shooting he is going to be lethal 91 finishing with 86 shot power is gonna be incredible. Great traits as well, finesse shot, flare, power header, and techno dribbler should elevate his game to the next level. He looks lengthy, he looks fun. Let's get into the first game and see what he can do. Ladies and gentlemen, it's match day. That boy Schick on the ball, he feels pretty slow, but we, we knew that already. Do you say so? He is here to score goals, and he's going to get his first shot. My man, my man, my brother, Patrick Schick. You gotta know what you're getting. You're getting a lengthy striker. A true number nine is on your on your team with this guy for 23K. No one's gonna finish the ball like him. Oh my God, Schick, Schick. Oh, it's missed. Almost, almost, bro, almost a flying ninja kick. Looking like Holland out there. Yeah, I'd say so. Go Schick, hold up play. Let's go send him. I like it, I like it. He can hold up the ball pretty well because he does have four star skills, so we can hold. Oh, oh, we're in. We're in here, we're in here on his left, on his favorite left. Boom. Oh, lovely. Come on. The main man, Patrick Schick. I think if you are looking for a player like a Harry Kane, like a Benzema, like a Holland that is big, clunky, lengthy, but you can't afford them, Patrick Schick is the budget number nine in this game hold the play 6-3 six, 6-3 three, six, three frame 60 oh my days bro fading away on his three star weak foot that is ridiculous that is 90 plus finishing you hear 90 finishing you think okay that's good finishing but you have to realize that we are still in early october 90 finishing now is like 99 finishing in team of the season in the team of the season era his finishing is so good bro what is that that's actually like a glitch i swear that shouldn't go in on his weak foot fading away like that Wow. Shrek. Header. Oh, man. That is going to be another aspect of his game. The aerial duels. He can win a lot. We, we, we lose that one there, but, you know, it's always a threat. Shrek. Let's just test the dribbling. I, I don't like it. I don't I don't think I like the dribbling. Like, he feels so stiff. Oh, but yeah. No, no, guys. He's a, he's an out-and-out out number nine. Do not try and dribble with him. Passing meta all the way. Let's try some four-star skills. Let's try... Oh, Croquetta? On the left? Okay. Hey, when you do skill moves, his skill move execution is pretty smooth. Okay, never mind. But the dribbling, the left stick dribble. Okay, the left stick dribbling on its own is not great at all. I, I, I want to give him a, a second chance at a sort of show, show me something. But, but it's not great. Bovers, fake shot, coquetta, vamos. Okay, that was a nice little combination. That was okay. Okay, Patrick. Okay, Patrick. Oh. He has it in his locker. He has it in his locker. Get him in the box. Shield. Fake shot, score. Get him outside the box. Finesse shot, long shot, score. In the box, shield, shield. Fake shot, left. Oh my days. <laughs> Man, why? What? It, it, bro, blocks make my head hurt. There's room my day. I'm just trying to film a video on a Sunday. Vibe, and these blocks are not, uh, they're not agreeing with. Fake shot, get him on the left, get him on the left. Use acceleration. Oh my days, this keeper is incredible. Oh my God. Go, Patty, Patty, vamos! That was a nice run. That was a long run that I did not think he could do. Some of you guys may be like, Patrick Schick, what a bozo. 39 pace, I know, but this is not FIFA 22, this is not FIFA 21, this is not left stick short, 5'7", spin in a circle meta. This is pass lengthy striker number nine meta and he fits it. If you're gonna try Patrick Schick, leave a, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Yes, pace, pace, yes, buddy, 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 come on. Shh. Big shot in the box, bang. That is a type of goal. That is the template of goal that you need to score to make this guy successful. Get Schick in the box, back to goal, receive the ball, big shot, and then smash it on the left. It is, it is the most simple way to succeed with this card. It's a very easy way to score goals. Be patient and then just smash it home. Schick is worth every penny. 22,000 coins. I expect him to drop to around 20. He is great. 
you have to take value into consideration because there are a lot of good number nine strikers like Harry Kane, like Benzema, like Holland that are super expensive. Schick is not. Schick has 91 finishing, 86 shot power, 90 attack positioning, and a lethal left foot with four star skills as well four star skills is not bad it is not bad he may be stiff he may be slow but the skill moves can get him by at times you shouldn't rely on the skill moves for great performances time in and time out but if you need to get out of a get out of a situation with some skills send it see what happens but can stop for this card I i'm gonna have to go with the one and only architect the, the the length we need to make this guy lengthy and the best way to do that is with an architect passing and physical get that length up he already has good sprint speed good finishing the passing i like it 81 short passing is good the other stats other passing stats not so much long passing is really bad curve is good dribbling not going to be touched but he does have good ball control and good dribbling stats with high composure so that takes into consideration the weak foot three star weak foot with high composure it's really like a four star weak foot come on and then the heading accuracy 91 heading accuracy the man has got an absolute noggin on him we, we make jokes about harry Maguire having a big head patrick schick was built to score goals with his head it is ridiculous this guy is an aerial threat unlike anything i've ever seen low stamina but that's not gonna be too big of an issue because you're not gonna be drilling with him too much so his stamina should steadily decline in the game but but not not no peaks no peaks but 86 strength low aggression the strength should be enough to to get him by with that 6-3 frame of his felt really good in the box you turn the back in the box i've been saying it all video you turn the back 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 to goal in the box get the ball fake shot goal it is it is the simplest way to score goals in this game finesse shot flare as i as i said earlier in the video they are super super helpful an annoying thing about this card though is the links he needs either a bunch of Bundesliga links or he needs a strong link from Bayern Leverkusen which is not the easiest club to get strong links to but there is some good options like I would say Diaby, Herdeki, the whole goalkeeper linking to striker thing now is super helpful so these three uh Verts, Herdeki and Diaby are really good so is Tapsoba Ta, maybe if you're on a super big budget, but I would definitely recommend Diaby as a, as a link for him because Diaby's a perfect one to pair with him. Winger, fast, can cross the ball, very agile, while Schick is more number nine, big, clunky, gonna finish everything in front of his plate, and then here Deki just for Kem as well. So if you get the three of those guys in a squad, I think that could be really, really solid. Taking a look at some of the best forwards in the game, Benzema has 80 pace. Schick has more pace than Benzema. Benzema has a little bit more acceleration, but still, it's the same sort of vibe. High shooting, high finishing. So Benzema has 92 finishing. Schick has 90. And the, the shot power is very similar, almost a one difference. Benzema is a bit more agile and a bit better on the left stick and he has four star four star but he's a lot more expensive that's what you have to take into consideration with these cards also someone like erling holland has 89 pace but he is three star three star six four star three star finishing 94 finishing from Holland, 94 shot power obviously he's one of the best finishers in the game but Schick is the same sort of big clunky player Holland is 6'5 Schick is 6'3 very similar body type there you got the length you got the size the high heading accuracy the high strength and aggression and then finally someone like Harry Kane who has even less pace 67 who but it, but is someone who's being used by a ton of players this year because of his ability to finish in front of goal he can do it and so can Schick. Schick is the budget Harry Kane in, in FIFA. I swear, he's the budget Harry Kane. Schick has better heading accuracy. Schick has better pace. Schick has not five-star weak foot. Schick does have better skill moves and the three-star weak foot, but I think with the good finishing, he is more than fine on the three-star weak foot. Definitely better dribbling from Schick than Kane. Kane has high reactions. Kane a little bit better stamina, but you have to take into consideration the price, the price, links, everything. There, there's a lot, there's a big difference between Harry Kane and Patrick Schick when it comes to just ability and everything, when it comes to finesse, flair. There, there, there's, there's a bit of difference when it comes to links as well. I would say Harry Kane's a bit easier to link, but Patrick Schick is it's, it's more of a unique card. It's more of a fun card to use with your friends, use with your mates. And yeah, he's just, he, you gotta know what you're getting though. You, you cannot use his card thinking he's gonna be very agile, very quick, and a, a 
super silky player that can score on his own. He is a guy that needs teammates. He needs someone to pass the ball, someone to feed him the ball. So that's why Diaby is perfect. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Mm.